Rural communities residing in the flat plains of the Zambezi region are often cut from the rest of the country when the Zambezi River overflows its banks. The villages of Kasika, Ivilivinsi, Kaba and others have been depending on water transportation to reach the main town of Katimamulilo and other villages in order to access essential services such as clinics and hospitals. Schools are also at the receiving end during floods as it is difficult for learners to reach schools which often result in closure or relocation of most schools which often disturbs quality teaching and learning. The Road Authority's Chief Executive Officer Conrad Lutombi told the affected communities that life would become much easier for them once this road is completed. We are directed to fast track this project. I must tell you and it's not a secret. Is this project, if possible, maybe in the next, probably next month, you will see some heavy trucks bringing some uh, round, what we call the culverts, but they, they are uh, round uh, 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 culverts, so that we can already assess if we can put some temporal structure which can hold until when the road is fully constructed. Due to lack of necessary funds, the road would however first start with the depressions that are hampering movement, such as at Ishua, where it is close to impossible to cross. Lutombi says this would make it easy for the rural communities to access their villages and much needed government services, while the rest of the gravel road is under construction. Plans are also at an advanced stage to construct an access road at Impalila to make movement easier.